New day, new hat. I'm not gonna lose this one. Hey everybody, it's Ryan. Welcome back to How Farms Work. Andrew just pulled in with Crop Max's New Holland Sprayer. Today we are going to be Y dropping my 30 acre cornfield. So Andrew just pulled in, he is gonna load up here at the main farm and we are gonna head out to my field. automatically go from 72 inches to 78 inches tension. Automatically? Well, you can choose it to ride in auto mode, so in auto mode it's going to fine tune the wheels. Okay. So you're riding pretty level. Uh, so if you're on a side hill, it will kind of compensate for that. But, you know, when I'm going through tall corn like this, I'm almost 78 inch suspension, so I get max yep. high underneath the corn. Normally we'll just run it at 72 inches. Okay. So we're in the New Holland Sprayer with Andrew. Andrew, what are we putting down today? Uh, we're putting down 32% uh, nitrogen solution and 10% uh, ammonium fat sulfate. Okay, so it's pretty late in the season, so we are Y dropping the nutrients closer to the base of the plant to kind of help push them through the rest of the season. Yeah. We got some plants out there that are tasseling. Overall, this field looks really good. But we're gonna go ahead and get started. Yep. So this field's had 100 units of nitrogen so far, and as you can tell, there is no yellowing of the plants. This corn is not lacking anything. But if you don't get the remainder of the nitrogen on, there's a good possibility it'll fail. <laughs> that you would run out. Mineralization is always uh, kind of a guess. We don't know how much nitrogen that organic matter is going to produce for your crop. Yep. But nitrogen is oh. one of those things you don't want to run short on, you don't want to take chances. So. Overall, as far as the corn is concerned, I mean, it's been a great year for growing because it's had a lot of sunshine. Not as much as we usually get because of all the rain we've gotten, but I think the rain has really helped yeah. as much as we've gotten to kind of push the corn plant through the season. Right. Yeah, this is probably some of the most consistent looking corn that I've seen out there. Um, it pains me to drive through it because <laughs> I definitely don't want to leave any tracks, but you can see we're going five mile an hour. Um, I've been going even slower on the contour just to make sure, you know, we don't run anything down. And, yep. What kind of rate are we putting down? 25 gallon of the acre. Okay. How many acres can you cover in an hour with this thing when you're booking? <laughs> when I'm booking? Yeah. Uh, if I've got really good going, then I can go about 11 to 12 mile an hour. Um, I'd say about 30 to 40. Right. No. Okay. So as you see, now we got on a little bit of a slope to the left. So I really got to, you know, lean this thing and, and um, steer toward the left side of that row in order to not run down corn. As the terrain changes, this machine does not uh, have a whole lot of room. The way these tires are yep. and the tires we have on the machine and the way the uh, tires are set on the machine, there's really only about an inch or two leeway um, to either side before you start hitting rows. Hmm. And so you get on any sort of a slope or side hill and that one to two inches goes away really fast. Yep. Yeah, it's like 
This is the best looking corn back here I've ever seen. <laughs> I was gonna say, it, especially wide dropping this, I mean, here you can see that the corn's getting a little yellower because yeah. of the trees. Yeah, and yeah, it's probably shallow soil. It is, so. definitely. So this has swath control? It does, yeah. This actually has, it's not set up to do with these drops, but it's got the independent nozzles. You see those boxes on every nozzle? Those are chipped. And there's a, there's a computer chip in each one. And there's a solenoid with a pop that opens and closes those. Yeah. You know. Sounds expensive. That's a $40,000 option. Wow. But when you're running over a lot of acres, it's necessary. Eight? Yeah, it, we're about five acres an hour more efficient with those. Right. And yeah, they're, they're definitely working. How much fun is it to clean the sprayers off at the end of the year? <laughs> oh, we clean them off at the end of the week. Oh, really? Oh, yeah. Did you hear what happened to me yesterday? Oh, yeah, you should hear. Tire? Oh, yeah. yeah. How'd that funny. happen? The valve stem corroded. Oh, yeah, really? it just came off. Yeah, the valve stem split going down the road. Yeah, and like that, the air is out of the tire and off the rim. Can you run me through real quick what the buttons on the controller do? Yeah, so this is your master on off. Okay. Um, left side raise up and down, center raise up and down, and right side raise up and down. Oh, so that's for the suspension? No, for the booms. So raise the wings. So. Oh, okay. So yeah, I'm raising the right wing. Yep. And then lower. Okay. And then, and then uh, these are, so it's a 10 section boom. Yep. Each one of these controls two sections manually. Okay. Yep. So this is my gear selector. I got to hold that in and then there's a button behind to raise and lower. Yep. And if you look up top, right now I only have first gear enabled. Now I've got second gear enabled. See how it turns white? Yep. So now if I put the joystick all the way forward, I'll go to 35 mile an hour. Okay. But when I have those down, like in that case, I'll go to six miles an hour. Yep. So like field speed and road speed? Yes, definitely.
there you have it. We just finished Y dropping my 30 acre no till cornfield. So this went a lot better than I expected. So, yeah. And look at that. I don't see tracks. No. Nope. There's a few out there, but. Nah, it'll be alright. I'm sure it'll make a difference. Oh, it makes a huge difference. So. Alright, well, we're gonna head out. Thanks. Thanks for riding. That's pretty much it for this video, guys. Thanks for watching. Be sure to check out all of our other videos. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And be sure to check us out on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and Snapchat. All how farms work. And do you want to have any shameless plugs in there, Andrew, for yourself? No? No oh, shit. Yeah. All right, he's good. <laughs> all right, thanks for watching, guys. I'm really looking forward to harvest. I think that the corn is going to do great this year with all those added nutrients. I knew I was missing something when I started the day off. Rocket, what's today's hint? You got a confession to make? What confession? I don't know. That's all he said. Anyway, that's today's hint. Thanks for watching, guys.